Hey game boys and girls and all assembled. My name is Alacris, I'm the main organizer for Taltech Game Camp and today I'm going to give you a small tutorial on how to use our brand new website for our upcoming event, Taltech Game Camp Lite. Ever since the event in March we garnered a lot of support from all of you guys and so we decided to work in the summer a little bit and bring back Game Camp in October already. But with one small twist, we actually created our own website so we can host the jam entirely on our own platform. So today I'm going to be showcasing our website, how to register on there, how can you make a team or join a team, and then hopefully you can get prepared for the upcoming jam in October. If anyone doesn't know, our website is gamecamp.etook.ee, which is also accessible through the description down below. And when you open the site, you will be greeted with this new and fresh website design showing the countdown exactly to when the jam is going to start and also the dates. Say I'm a new user and I would like to register for the jam. So you click up here, sign up to register. And in collaboration with the Taltec IT student faculty, uh, we had a small authentication page here. If you don't have an account, then you can press sign up or continue with Google. So I'm gonna continue with Google. All right, so you're met with this profile editing page. So here you can put your own username or whatever alias you want to have. Also your Discord username, profile picture link, uh, whatever picture you want to host there, and then description. In the description, uh, most of you we probably want to put some like portfolio stuff and whatnot, but here we thought that it would be the best to give you a suggestion to write what language you should speak. So people who want to join your team uh, could also see uh, what sort of language you should speak and then ask you in that appropriate language. So let me just quickly fill up my profile over here. And from here you can also pick your skills. So I'm actually a 2D artist. So let me click that. So regarding the profile picture link, you can actually pick any image on Google or whatever internet place. You just right click on that image, click copy image link, and then you can paste that image here. I also want to put a banner of Talta Game Camp here. So once you're happy with the profile, you can click in the upper right corner, submit, and it should save your profile. Awesome, I can already see my picture there. Now it's time to actually register for the jam. So you can go ahead and click here, and this will bring you to the general event page, which all the stages of the actual jam are located in. You can also access this page and all our upcoming events in the hamburger bar in the top left, and go under events, and then you can see. But since we're already here, we're just going to register. So this pop-up here, lets you choose whether you're coming on site or you're participating remotely. As organizers, we require this information because we are hosting this event in real life as well. And so we want to know how many people we're going to accommodate. So let's say I'm coming on site. That will pretty much do a plus one in account for us. And then we know exactly how many of you are coming. So make sure you pick it accordingly. Then I'm going to hit register. And also, if you want to edit your submission or just leave the event entirely, you can click on the same button again and then either switch and save or just leave the event. But right now, I'm choosing to attend my own event as well. We actually are hosting it back in the same place in the Mectory house. So you can get a little bit more information and sneak peeks on our latest Instagram post at Toltec.GameCamp. Self-promotional plug aside, now we can start picking a team or making a team. So if we go under the Teams tab, that will open a small list for all the teams that we can see. And this is also a small tick here, show only available teams. If you're creating a team, which I will showcase now, we actually have a tick box right here that says available to join. So this is useful for when you want to close the gates early for your team. So for example, all of your friends are already joined and you don't need any more team members, then you can just untick that and then save changes. But for now, Let's say I'm looking for everyone, so I'm just gonna make a team now. Also a password. This password is used to join the team, so usually how you can retrieve the password if you want to join a team is you hover over a person's profile picture and then you can see their Discord username so you can contact them and ask the password. And let's say I'm looking for programmers. And now we can create our team. And there we go. If you go under the Teams page again, you can see that you have actually a separate view for your own team. So we can see Alacris's awesome team. Hovering over the members in the team, you can actually see their description that they submitted in the profile. So let's say I want to join the team beginners. They have actually put their Discord username there. So I can just contact them 
through Discord using that way and then ask for the password. But let's say I want to delete the team. Well, in that case, I have to resubmit the password again and then I just click delete team. And as you can see, the team has been removed from the view. So let's say I want to join a team. Again, as mentioned before, you need to password and to get the password, you just contact any one of the team members here. Usually contacting the owner or creator of the team is the best idea because this is the first person and only person sometimes to actually be in the team. So this should get you registered for the jam. If you happen to experience some bugs, we kindly acknowledge that this is a beta launch still and since we have a month to work out the kinks and bugs then you can let us know in our discord server uh, in the bug reports channel if you want to find our discord you just go back to our homepage through this little game camp icon here scroll down a little bit and then you can see our discord server tab so you can just click here or here doesn't really matter and then you can just let us know whether or not you're having any bugs Please be as descriptive as possible on how you experience this bug. This will help us developers to quickly attack the issue and eventually solve it. We've already gotten some bug reports, so thank you to everyone who have reported. We have hopefully solved all the issues at, to this point. Thank you again for watching this website tutorial. Hopefully you got enough information to get registered to the jam. If you have any questions, you can contact me directly at alacrisdevs or in our Dolta GameCam Discord server, you can let us know there. But thank you for tuning in and we'll see you at GameCam. Woo!